Worldwide, Dirty Water. I love that Dirty Water TV. Love that Dirty Water TV. I love that Dirty Water TV. I love that Dirty Water TV. I really do. The best. Ow! What's up, everybody? Welcome to Dirty Water TV. I'm Kendra Middleton. And I'm Gianna Gravelisi. And tonight, we're coming to you from Harbor Lights Bar and Cafe, located along the Harbor Walk at Rockland Trust Bank Pavilion. Usually, this place is rocking with live music and outdoor entertainment, but you know, this year, it's a little bit different. Yeah, Live Nation has actually partnered with Night Shift Brewing to bring you these incredible views of Boston Harbor with the hottest ticket in drinking and dining at Harbor Lights Bar and Cafe. We have so many options for dining and drinking coming up for you tonight. We have an awesome show planned for you. Let's see what's on tap. Sam Berger takes us to the courtyard in Katamit for a screwball summer bash. Ashley Bedard enjoys some screwball peanut butter mudslides at the Black Cat in Hyannis. And we're off to the vineyard for a screwball summer party at the legendary Sandbar. But first, the screwball summer tour continues with a trip to the Lobster Bar in Newport, Rhode Island. And that's tonight's big ticket brought to you by Higgs Tickets. The dog days of summer are upon us. Those hot summer days and nights where you're just looking for relief. Newport, Rhode Island is that place on the waterfront. Not only do you get the sunshine, but the sun sets. Great food and drinks. Cheers to a screwball summer. Let's dive in. The Lobster Bar is located in the center of downtown Newport at the very end of historic Bones Wharf. They provide 180 degrees of unobstructed water views and both some of the best sunsets and harbor views in Newport. We're open, you know, it's, it's Newport, summertime, we're out here on the water, come and visit us. Their menu features lobster, of course, while also offering something for everyone. Their raw bar is second to none. The lobster is what you have to get. It's fresh, it's straight out of the, the water, we have them tanks running uh, right from the water from the bay here. We chill it to the perfect temperature and uh, you know, it's as fresh as it gets. Our stuffed cold hogs, our, our, our fried uh, cold hogs are very good on the appetizer menu. Um, also, we have a whole belly fried clam plate. That's an entree that is fantastic, a very good size. And then also, you cannot go wrong with a boiled lobster. We have uh, a variety of sizes. You come in, we'll help you crack it if we need it to, and we'll get it done. Some nice hot butter sauce with some good sides. It's fantastic. Whether you're looking for a relaxed night out or hosting a private event, Lobster Bar is a unique venue that epitomizes quintessential Newport. We love Perfect. alfresco dining, it's super fun, and we're having fun. While fresh seafood is also a main attraction here at the Lobster Bar, their signature screwball peanut butter summer cocktail also has a wide appeal. It's amazing. It's like a cookie. <laughs> it's a cookie. The screwball peanut butter whiskey, that's the hot thing of the summer, everybody loves that. It's flying off the shelf. So I just made the peanut butter painkiller. So that is the screwball whiskey, that is the dark goslings rum, that is also a splash of pineapple juice, and then one of our fantastic creamers that we add on top of the painkiller, and then voila, with a pineapple wedge. That painkiller is kind of dangerous. Very dangerous. It's uh, one of our new items on the menu this summer, and it's been a it's been a um, it's been a hit. Summertime is the best time to visit Newport, Rhode Island, and here at the Lobster Bar, not only do you get those 360 views, but you get great food, good drinks, and I highly recommend the Painkiller. Reporting for Dirty Water Media, I'm Cassie Arsenal. Can we get another one of these? That's tonight's big ticket. Brought to you by Higgs Tickets. Here's what else is going on around town. Hi, I'm Higgs, so call me, get tickets, and be part of the action. Newport is just so picturesque in the summertime, and they have some of the best sunsets around. Absolutely. Switching gears, we're actually going to send it over to Sam Berger, who's at the Courtyard in Katamit for a screwball summer party. The summer of 2020 has had its challenges. We sure know that. One thing you can always count on, though, in the summer are beautiful beach days, gorgeous summer nights, signature cocktails, and amazing people with great food. Tonight we're at the perfect place on Cape Cod, the Courtyard, and tonight Screwball Whiskey is here. We're gonna have a couple toasts with them. 
why don't we go inside and have a good time? The courtyard on Cape Cod has been known for decades as the destination venue for some of the hottest summer nights all on Cape Cod. And tonight is no different. Owned and operated by former Boston Bruin and Los Angeles King Jay Miller and his wife Paula, the courtyard has been a popular spot for people looking for great food and great fun on Cape Cod. I've been here uh, 29 years, my 29th summer. We're open year round, 365 days a year. Um, we've been uh, open, as, as you can see, this is like a normal day. Uh, COVID's hurt us a little bit, but it's not bad. We're going to keep a nice line. Everybody has masks on, so it'll be fine. Located in rustic historical building on Route 28A, just in the line between Bourne and Falmouth, the courtyard has long received accolades from many publications and TV outlets. A lot of my friends like always come here and we always like reunite here for like holidays and stuff. The atmosphere is great, the outdoor seating is awesome, great drinks, great people. They take great pride in using the freshest ingredients available to create dishes like seafood specialties. My go-to is the blackened meatloaf that I got from Wolfgang Puck when I played in LA 40 years ago. But uh, tonight I caught six yellowfin out in the canyons, and uh, tonight we have the fresh yellowfin on the special, which uh, we're almost sold out of one fish already. And as the sun goes down, the courtyard heats up. The venue is well known as the place everyone wants to be. Patrons come for the signature screwball peanut butter whiskey cocktails. I just been the screwball, I'll tell you that. Yeah, it's yeah. been going off the shelf. Yeah. I do not drink personally, but I hear everybody that I'm talking, my daughter, even my wife said uh, the screwball. Peanut butter and jelly, I what I understand. And I'm going to make a uh, screwball concoction with uh, called Island of Misfits. We're going to do it with the screwball whiskey first. And then we're going to pour in the cream coconut. And then we're also going to pour in the orange juice followed by pineapple juice. Once we shake that up, we're going to put a little topper of Myers on there. And there's your Island of Misfits. One thing is for sure. You just never know who you're going to bump into at the courtyard. I always have an oyster, or a stuffed quahog, and a frozen mudslide. You can't beat that. That's Cape Cod. Welcome, Welcome to, to the Screwball Summer, Summer Store on Dirty Water TV. The Courtyard's signature Saturday night specials are lobster rolls, fried clams, and prime rib. Mix that with a tasty screwball cocktail, and you're in line for a fantastic summer evening here on Cape Cod. Reporting for Dirty Water Media, I'm Sam Berger. Up next, the Summer Screwball Series continues at the Black Cat in Hyannis. And later, we'll go inside the Harbor Lights Bar and Cafe. That's when Dirty Water TV returns. Welcome back to Dirty Water TV. I'm Gianna Gravelisi. And I'm Kendra Middleton. Gianna, did you know that the original name of this place was actually Harbor Lights Pavilion? So it is quite fitting that we're actually in Harbor Lights Bar and Cafe. Every day is a school day, but let's go check in with Ashley Bedard at the Black Cat on Cape Cod. Ashley, take us away, sis. I'm here in Hyannis at the Black Cat Tavern. It's a beautiful spot, only made better by the amazing food, cocktails, and atmosphere. Let's have a screwball summer and sail off into the sunset. The Black Cat Tavern is a casual waterfront restaurant located right on the docks of Hyannis Harbor. Dine inside where the look is classic seaside style or outside on their heated patio while watching the boat sail by. The menu features everything from thick, juicy burgers and garden fresh salads to fresh native seafood and prime beef. I had the halibut, which was a special tonight, and it was phenomenal. Service was unbelievable and cleanliness and safety was great. This is our uh, seafood fried Diablo, our famous lobster roll, yep. and then our chicken stir fry. 
The Black Cat Tavern serves lunch, dinner, and Sunday brunch with entertainment four nights a week in their lounge. Located right next door, stop into the Black Cat Harbor Shack where you can relax while eating Cape Cod Fair and drinking summer cocktails on their front porch while watching the ferries go by. I just, I love it. We're having a wonderful time at this beautiful location. It's just a fun atmosphere, great people, good music, good food. It just feels like summer. And don't miss Cape Cod's newest hidden gem, the Shack Out Back Raw Bar. It's a quaint outdoor oasis tucked behind the harbor shack. Grab a stool at the roomy bar and watch your oysters and clams shuck fresh to order. Or have a seat at one of the covered tables and savor their award-winning clam chowder. Looking for a great lobster roll? The Shack Out Back has one of the best. It's all one family restaurant. The Black Cat Tavern has inside dining well outside dining. They're more traditional in the sense of formal wear. At the Black Cat Shack Out Back, it's all outside. And we have uh, more paper plates. It's very casual, and that's where I talked about the backyard environment. That's what you get the Black Cat Shack out back. Screwball whiskey. I hear that screwball whiskey. Blow my blue zoe. Which brings us to the summer cocktails. Mudslides. This is the perfect time. <laughs> nice mudslides. Thank you. We featured the Black Cat venues because they epitomize what it means to celebrate a screwball summer. So let's check out the signature screwball cocktails they're offering this summer. We're making a screwball mudslide. I'm going to be using the screwball peanut butter whiskey first with an Irish cream liqueur and a coffee liqueur. And we're using a mudslide mix. I'm gonna mix these three and blend it, and it's gonna be an amazing drink. I tried the peanut butter, uh, the peanut butter whiskey. It's called Screwball tonight. It was really, really good. I was surprised. I don't usually drink whiskey, but it it went down really smooth, and we all loved it. Everyone's loving it. We love that dirty water. Hyannis has been long known as the Oasis by the Sea and is Kennedy's summer playground. Well, now it can be known for Screwball cocktails and some of the best Cape Cod fare around. Reporting for Dirty Water Media, I'm Ashley Bedard. Thanks, Ashley. You know, it's always a great time when screwball peanut butter whiskey is in the house. Ugh, those mudslides are to die for, Gianna. But we're going to go to the sandbar at Oaks Bluff Harbor where Alex Garino is ready to show us a great time. Summer is not complete without a trip to Martha's Vineyard to watch the sun set over Oak Bluffs Harbor. And there's one location here in Oak Bluffs where you can literally eat fried clams and drink delicious frozen cocktails with your toes in the sand. And if that's not the definition of a screwball summer, then I don't know what is. Located right on the harbor, a few minutes from the Oak Bluffs Ferry, the sandbar is the place for great food, great fun, and a great island atmosphere. The beach bar is perfect for young parties coming to enjoy themselves. We're our number one bachelorette destination on the vineyard. We're so excited to host people, even during COVID. Everyone's got their mask, but they're going to be social distancing. COVID is obviously a really tough time on the island and nationwide, but you know what? We're making the best of it, and we're going to make sure that we have an awesome time on these hot summer nights. The island is a fantastic place to be. The Sandbar is Martha's Vineyard's only beach bar, serving up some of the finest local seafood, burgers, wings, tacos, raw bar, and more. We have a lot of tourists, so we're in New England, so the best part is lobster roll. That's one of my favorite here. And also our special signature item is fish and chips. Okay. It's lightly beer batter, and you just love it. It's two huge fillet of um, haddock and comes with chips, you know, like french fries or tater tots if you want, and comes with coleslaw. But uh, I definitely would not miss the lobster roll. With indoor and outdoor dining and three bars, Sandbar guarantees a good time in the sun. I mean, I've been coming here ever since I was little. I live over in Falmouth, so we take the boat ever, like every Friday night, Saturday night. And this place to me, I like, I love Nancy's, but coming here is just, like, the vibes are unmatched. Come and enjoy a delicious meal or relaxing cocktail with your toes in the sand while the sun sets and the island heats up for some vineyard nightlife. Because when the sun sets, that's when the screwball summer kicks into high gear. We're really uh, excited about the screwball cocktail. Um, it's a uh, banana split mudslide. It's really fun. It's awesome. Uh, great for hot summer nights. A mudslide drink that's actually a banana split mudslide. 
Um, so it's a peanut butter flavor and banana mudslide. We use a screwball uh, whiskey, peanut butter flavor one. It's delicious. Tequila, uh, we use it for a jalapeno margarita. So we muddle jalapeno with some agave nectar. Tequila, triple sec, sour mix. It's delicious, spicy and sweet. The Sandbar is one of those classic Cape and Island venues where you know you're gonna get a great meal, fantastic drinks, and get to enjoy an oceanside atmosphere. You always feel like you're on vacation at the Sandbar. Reporting for Dirty Water Media, I'm Alex Carino. Up next, we'll go inside Harbor Lights Bar and Cafe. That's when Dirty Water TV continues. Welcome back to Dirty Water TV. I'm Kendra Middleton. And I'm Gianna Gravelisi. And we are here with Jason, the general manager of Harbor Lights Bar and Cafe. So Jason, can you guys tell me how you came up with the concept for this during kind of a crazy time? Yeah, it is a crazy time. Um, obviously we don't have any concerts this season, but we wanted to reimagine the space. We have such a beautiful VIP club. And so we thought, what better way to kind of double down on the view and uh, we had the ability to play music and it all kind of culminated together and created this beautiful space. And Jason, what relationship does Night Shift Brewery have with the other cocktails here? Yeah, so Night Shift is our flagship uh, brand for the space. So we feature their products prominently. It's a great partnership. Um, I think it's going to be a win-win for both of us. Um, we have a lot of other cocktails as well, beer types and draft beers and frozen drinks and all the rest. Can you tell me a little bit about like the contactless payment you guys are doing and the QR codes, how that's all working? Sure, it was real important to us that safety come first. So uh, we were able to institute contactless payment through an, uh, an app and all you have to do is scan a QR code, the entire menu pops up on your phone and you can order completely contactless and even pay using the app. So. Really, the only contact you have with the uh, server is the drinks or the food coming to your table. And Jason, I know you mentioned live entertainment, so what can people look forward to as they're eating and drinking here? Yeah, we have the ability to play background music. Um, we're also able to play sports games. Fortunately, we are not doing live entertainment because of some of the restrictions put in place. but. We still have uh, a great environment that we know a lot of people want. I'm a foodie, so I have to ask about Regina Pizza and the lobster rolls you guys have to offer here this year. Yeah, those are two of our specialty items. So Regina's Pizza is baked here on site, and the lobster roll um, also um, comes to life here. And it's a great option, uh, along with a few other really cool features uh, in food. And when can people expect the music to be back? It's hard to say. Um, so we're hoping as soon as possible uh, and we're aiming for 2021 with fingers crossed. Thanks so much, Jason. I know you guys are working hard to make this such a special summer during such a crazy time. Thanks so much. Hope to see you guys on down here. Well, baby, what song you made me want to roll my windows down and crew, yep. What do you want your 
your legacy to be? I know your career is far from over, but what do you want people to remember and think about when they hear your music and your name on songs that are written? I've been asked that before, and I said it one time. I was like, yeah, that makes perfect sense, because at the end of the day, you can put out big songs. You can put out great songs, well-written songs. But if you're not believable, it doesn't matter. Um, so I, I think at the end of the day, as long as people just believe what I'm saying and believe, believe my music and believe me, that's all you can really ask for. What's up, y'all? I'm Chase Rice here at Trader Ed's on Cape Cod. I love that dirty water TV. has been providing people with fun, safe outdoor adventures to create memories that will last a lifetime. Welcome back to Dirty Water TV. I'm Kendra Middleton. And I'm Gianna Gravelisi. And thank you so much to all the staff here at Harbor Lights Bar and Cafe. Special shout out to Jay Anderson and Andy Egan at Live Nation. Don't forget to log on to dirtywatermedia.com for all your nightlife news. And follow us at Dirty Water Media on all your social media handles. You know, Kendra, we have a saying here on Dirty Water TV. The weekend may be over, but the party never ends on, on Dirty, Dirty Water, Water TV. TV.